It is Friday and I feel like every day in these vlogs are like <laughs> the exact same. I wake up, I go to work, I make coffee and I edit the video from the day before and eat dinner, watch TV and then I go to bed and that's basically it every single day because honestly there are a lot of interesting things happening in my life right now which I feel is the same for all of us but you know I'm gonna like make something later today I think either like actually cook something, bake something, make something because I need to do something with my life <laughs> burger. I have a little bit of this chili baked cheese. It's really nice. And we have some burger bread. And apparently it snowed last night or something. Because all the snow disappeared. sit down and edit the video for yesterday I found myself a glass of wine and then I also posted a uh, like a star story on Instagram so remember to follow me there if you don't already it's at crispy black as well and I asked if I should keep this pink and I asked if I should keep this pink for a little while longer or if I should dye it green and uh, it's only been like a few hours since I posted it but it's like super heavy on keeping the pink for a while longer right now also you can see with like this is starting to fade out the pink as well is pretty faded I do have a different color on the top than on the bottom because the um, the roots that I had were pretty yellow after I just did a bleach bath I didn't actually like bleach them properly uh, so I covered them up with a darker pink. I'm gonna <clears throat> edit my video from yesterday. I don't know how much footage I have yet, but it's probably gonna take me an hour or two. And then I'm gonna upload that. And then I really have to fix my nails because they're not very great. And then like I said, I wanna bake something or make something. And then I should also dye my eyebrows. So if I don't do that today, I'll do it tomorrow. I edited the video, made thumbnail, uploaded it, and then I watched a couple of YouTube videos while doing so. My plan was to make like vegan uh, locks, but that takes like three hours in the oven. And it, it's just eight o'clock, but I don't know if I'm gonna be awake for that long, to be honest. I know Marius wants me to make candied almonds, which is fairly quick. So maybe I'll just do that and then I should also find some food. Let's just make the almonds. Okay, we got a pot, pack of almonds, and then sugar um, here. And then if I remember correctly, I also need some water. Okay, so I found one with 250 grams of almonds, 125 grams of um, sugar, and then 0.75 deciliters of water. So you're just gonna boil it up with the water and the sugar and the um, almonds and then just move it around basically. So that's what we're doing.
I'm gonna do my eyebrows. They have to sit for like 15, 20 minutes and then I can just do my, like brush my teeth and stuff while that works. <sighs> this is the one that I'm using. This is Kuro Krem, which is a permanent dye for eyebrows. And this is in the color Ash Brown. It's almost empty. It comes with the cream, the uh, hydrogen peroxide. I also did my nails. Since I can't do my hair green, since you guys prefer the pink, I'm gonna do my nails green instead. I really like uh, neon green nails. It just gives me like, I don't know, it's like, a, it's a mood to have green nails. brows just makes me feel like a little bit put together even if I don't apply any makeup and stuff um, and I do like this ash brown color I feel like it's dark enough and it's still natural enough my camera is not very happy with me because it's running out of battery hopefully it can live through this if it dies you know why and I basically just use this and apply it to my brows and then once it gets uh, darker, I can like go through, wipe it off where it's not supposed to be before it sets. And then I'm just gonna brush my hair and put on some hair oil because my hair needs a little bit of love. It is getting pretty long though, which I'm happy about. It goes down to my chest now could actually use a little bit of a trim so maybe I'll just trim it a little bit as well and I just basically just ta take the bottom um, off. and because I never go to the hairdresser anymore so I just chop my hair myself when I feel like it's getting a little bit um, not great looking and then I also take care to use like um, masks and oils and a good conditioner. I feel like that's a little better. But just when the ends get super thin, you know. And they kind of just need like a needle. They look like they need a little bit of a refresh. And my sink's full of hair, so I'm just gonna wipe that off with some paper towels and throw that in the trash. Let me know what your favorite hair oils is. I've been using this from Inecta, which I just feel like I have to use so much of it. And I would like to I have one that I could use a little bit less of, but still like get the same effect. Because when, when I initially apply the oil, I like it to look a little bit like oily and shiny. Because that will just soak right into my hair anyway. I also want to try like the you mix um, coconut oil with leave-in conditioner and water and then you can like spray that into your hair um, for like a deep conditioning treatment so I'm gonna try that too at some point it like feels nice and healthy now um, probably because of the oil that I put in it um, you can also see that it's not like super oily shiny anymore it's just shiny I think all of the pink hairs fell on the floor because there's none of them in the sink I honestly don't know if it's been enough time. For sure they are darker though. I'm just using some micellar water to wipe it off. Did that even help? I don't know. Okay, I think it's a little bit darker. I'm gonna go to bed. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a big like. Leave any comments down below. Um, subscribe. If you haven't done so already, you can do that too down below. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. 
I just said that. Bye.